not much time or ingredients on hand? Today, let's make a three ingredient baked Italian dressing chicken. I'm Jamie with Savory Saver. I share gluten-free recipes, tips, tricks, and resources to make your gluten-free lifestyle easier. So please consider hitting subscribe and let's get started. So this recipe doesn't take any time hardly to put together. I've got two large chicken breasts that I have pounded out just a little bit so they cook faster. And I've cut them crosswise just to give me four portions. And it makes it a little easier at the end of the recipe to not have to cut it again. So this is about a pound of chicken. And I'm just going to put it into a small casserole dish. We are baking it, of course. So I've got my oven set to 375 degrees. Next. I'm gonna add my Italian dressing. This is a wishbone three cheese Italian dressing. Make sure your dressings are gluten-free, of course. This one's very similar to Olive Garden's as far as I'm concerned. You wanna add about a cup. Let's coat that and see how that is. We can always add a little more if we need to. You could also marinate this, of course, for a while if you wanted to. I didn't spray the bottom of this. I think we're gonna be fine because of the oil in the dressing. I'm gonna sprinkle a little bit of pepper on it. We're not gonna count that extra ingredient because you probably have that on hand. I'm not gonna use any salt because there's a lot in the dressing. Our third ingredient, some Parmesan cheese. I'm gonna shred this while the chicken bakes. You could also use that powdered stuff, guys. Not gonna be any judgment here because if I didn't have this on hand, I would. You want about half a cup, so of course enough to coat the chicken. I'm gonna bake this uncovered for about 20 to 25 minutes probably. I want the chicken mostly cooked through. Then I'll add shredded cheese over the top. You want an internal temperature of 165. So I'm gonna pop this in the oven for 20 minutes and then I'll show you guys what I'm gonna do with the cheese and we'll finish it off. So it's been about 20 minutes. Our chicken isn't quite cooked through. We've got about another 30 degrees to go, but I'm gonna to top it with my Parmesan cheese. Pop it back in the oven for about another 10 to 15 minutes until it's cooked through. So our three ingredient baked Italian dressing chicken is done. Took 30 minutes, 20 minutes, and then 10 minutes with the cheese so it could melt and the chicken could finish baking through. Smells really good. Let's give it a taste. Guys, it's juicy. We didn't need any extra salt. It's got plenty of flavor. I can taste that Italian dressing throughout and that was without marinating. The cheese melted on top is great. I think you could still use the powdered stuff if you have it and that's the only thing you have. I also think that if you didn't have Parmesan, use whatever type of Italian blend of cheese that you have out of the bag or a slice of provolone whatever you like. Guys, that's all I have for today. Let me know your thoughts on this three ingredient recipe. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you on the next video.